Hey there, Aquarius. And welcome back for a general love reading. This reading is going to be for the person that is secretly crushing on you. Now, this could be somebody that you know. It could be somebody that you don't know. But it is a general. So only take the part that fits that you know of and disregard the rest because it is a general. If this video resonates, Aquarius, please like, share, and subscribe. Universal energy of light and love. What is the energy of the person or the people that is secretly crushing on Aquarius? Who is secretly crushing on Aquarius? Aquarius, who is secretly crushing and spying on Aquarius? Who is secretly crushing and spying on Aquarius? So let's see. Six of Wands, so you seem to be getting a lot of attention here. It could be somebody checking you out on your job or you just on flick. You're very, very successful. You're getting a lot of attention. Uh, but that attention is making the haters, though. Three of Cups, see? Somebody may not like it that you're getting all the ladies or you're getting all the men. So it seems like you got a lot of jealousy. Nine of Pentacles, or you seem to be doing your thing. Maybe it's because you rejected love. Four of Wands, oh, it's almost like you about your money, Aquarius. See, that's in the upright. You may have walked away from somebody and somebody from your past can't get over it. It's what it seemed like. Mm. Could be dealing with a Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. With the Three of Cups, Ace of Cups, Eight of Cups, and the Six of Cups. Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries with the Five, Six, and Four of Wands. Uh, Nine of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. So it look like you got your mind on your money, your money on your mind, and you ain't looking for no love or no commitment. And it could be the same person that's looking at you. I feel like there's some envy. I feel like not only do you got jealousy, people jealous of you because you seem like you got it going on. But I also feel like it's people, it could be your partner, your romantic partners who you're not engaging romantically because you're focused on your finances and your career, your money goals, and you just ain't got time for love right now. You probably feel like love is going to get in the way. So it looks like it's somebody from your past here, Aquarius. All right, looks like it's somebody from your past that is secretly crushing on you and spying on you. And they be, may be feeling some type of way because you coming off as non-committal. All right. Now, I ain't throwing shade. I'm just telling you what I see. All right. Six of Wands. Who is secretly crushing on Aquarius? Yeah, I feel like somebody in their feelings or somebody. I just feel like there's a lot of gossip, a lot of. Conf confusion here could be a Scorpio why is the six of wands here for the person secretly crushing on Aquarius I feel like somebody is watching you they see you getting a lot of attention or you have their attention but I feel like somebody see you being very very victorious and very very successful um, getting a lot of recognition you on your grind your money look good you're very independent you're self-sufficient you're an uh, independent boss and you just ain't got time for love here <laughs> It could be that folks see you as somebody here who is detached and very, very determined and disciplined that you ain't you, you ain't got time for love right now. All right. The person secretly crushing on Aquarius with the six of wands. Clarify the six of wands. King of Pentacles. See, I feel like I said, I feel like you focused on your money, honey. And you ain't looking for no relationship. So you may be loving them and leaving them and they can't handle it. See, they looking at you like you cold. Mm. Ooh, who is secretly crushing on Aquarius? I feel like somebody sees you this way. I feel like they want to date you, but I feel like you ain't got time. Eight of Cups, you may have walked away from this person. Or because you got the eight of cups twice. So it seems like Aquarius is not thinking about no relationship right now. But I feel like somebody wants you anyway, though. Who is this person secretly crushing on Aquarius with the six of wands?
Knight of Swords. Someone here could be looking at you like they could be looking at you like you're busy, busy, busy. You ain't got time for love and you're not making time for love. I feel like somebody's looking at you like you moving on and you ain't got time for this. If it don't make money, it don't make sense. You, you may you may you may randomly casually date, but it seems like you ain't looking for nothing real because you got the four ones in the reverse as well as the ace of cups and you got the ace of pentacles in the upright. One more card for the six of wands for the person secretly crushing on Aquarius. Why is this here? Knight of Pentacles. I feel like somebody looks at you like you, you, your objective is not love. You're moving on. And things may have completely slowed down with you and a romantic partner here. So it's almost like they're looking at you like you're not investing much of anything to this connection because your mind ain't focused on it. See, they go to eight of pentacles. See, somebody say your mind on your money. And I feel like they don't like it because they want your attention. I feel like you're not being bothered. And if you are being bothered, you ain't giving much of anything. It seems like. Why is this five of wands here for the person secretly crushing on Aquarius? Confusion, jealousy, gossip arguments, competition. Why is this five of wands here for the person secretly crushing on Aquarius? Y'all so hot. Eight of swords. Somebody stuck. I feel like it's the person that's stuck in your energy here. It's almost like somebody know. Oh, okay. Because they're in love. Could be somebody here who feels like you're their soulmate. Could be a Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. See, they're stuck, and I feel like you ain't doing them right. I feel like they, they need to go on. Maybe, they, maybe they're going to leave you alone. <laughs> Look. <laughs> oh, because I, I, I have never... I don't, yeah, I think I've dated Aquarius years ago. And it's different. <laughs> I don't think I've ever dated a Libra. Gemini, have you ever dated a Gemini? I don't think I've ever dated a Gemini. I have Geminis in my family, but I have dated Aquarius. But, <laughs> so don't think it's personal. It's not. I'm just saying. It's like, yo, yo, ready readings be intense. It's like you cold with it. Your energy is always the same when I read it. It's like you're cold, you're detached, you don't care about nobody but yourself. And I'm not saying that that's true, but it just seems like most of these Aquarius, they ain't focus on nothing but what they want. Death. There it is. Could be a Scorpio. I know my other readers, I know a lot of Scorpios be talking about Aquarius. So you could be dealing with an Aquarius here that uh, I mean, Aquarius, you could be dealing with a Scorpio. They feel like you guys are soulmates and they're still stuck on you because they probably still in love. And why you probably ain't giving them the time of day because you all about yourself. Oof. Mm. So now you got the queen of pentacles in the reverse. I feel like somebody wanted to be your, your wife or somebody wanted more. I feel like somebody wanted you to make them your priority, but you didn't. Somebody wanted more with you, but you didn't give it to them because that wasn't what you wanted. And now they're stuck because I feel like they're in love. I feel like this person is hoping things would turn around between the two of you. I feel like whoever this is, somebody sees themselves as being your wife. But I feel like you're not having it, though. I'm not going to say you're not going to take them out and date and you know what you know. But I feel like that's all you give. And I feel like you ain't giving much of anything. Three of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio and Pisces. Why is the Three of Cups here for the person secretly crushing on Aquarius? What's up with this Three of Cups? Like I said, somebody want to go out with you. They want to date. That, that may be all you're giving. It's just friendly little dates or friends with benefits is what I'm getting. See, told you. Page of swords. They checking you out. All right. They probably looking at you to see if you're dating anybody else. Whew, told you they spying on you. What's going on with Aquarius and their person who is secretly and crushing on Aquarius with the three of cups? Could be another air sign. Who is this person secretly crushing on Aquarius with this three of cups? Mm. 
the empress could be a Libra, could be your child's mother here. Ooh, it could be somebody you have a child with. Now, it could also, but that's Libra energy, could be somebody you having a child with or somebody here who. Wow, if you, if you ain't studying that empress, I know something wrong. So you got somebody here who feels like they're the right one for you. They feel like they could be everything you could ever need in a spouse. And you probably ain't, ain't even taking them serious. Somebody has a lot to offer and this person is manifesting you too. Could be a Pisces. Because they feel like you're the one. What's going on with the three of cups? For the person secretly crushing on Aquarius. Strength. Could be a Leo. But somebody may not have the courage to make it known because they may already know that you're not interested or that you're all about your your independence or your career. I feel like it's somebody from the past. That's what I feel like, because why would they be afraid and they're the freaking empress? It could very well be someone that you have children by. And they, they want it way much more with you, but clearly that ain't what you wanted. All right, the four ones in the reverse for the person secretly crushing on Aquarius. Twin flame, harmony, happy relationship, commitment, but that's in the reverse. Why is the four of wands here for the person secretly crushing on Aquarius? What's up with this four of wands? Mm. Queen of Cups. See, they was in love. That's what it was. I knew it when I saw that Two of Cups. Could be a Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. Yeah, this is somebody here who fell in love and they felt like it was a one-sided relationship. Oh, they are aware that you didn't treat them right, Aquarius. Because they said it was one-sided. It wasn't fair. Four of Wands. With the person secretly spying and crushing on Aquarius. What's up with this four wands in the reverse? Wow. Ace of swords. So somebody got to face the truth now. That maybe you're given to other situations here. Maybe you're not want to be bothered. Just saw the six of pentacles. Wow. I feel like somebody's realizing that maybe they have to face the truth about you. But it don't, but they still in love. See, so whoever this person was, I feel like they're getting cold. I feel like it's almost like so you turn somebody's heart cold because of the one side, because of selfishness. When somebody once was in love, now they cold. De trying to detach themselves. Because I feel like they feel rejected. See, so now they're turning, they're going to eventually turn their back on this. So if you really don't want this person, don't worry, because they're going to leave you soon anyway, and they're going to move on. Ace of Cups in the reverse, all these opportunities, and the only one that's in the upright is the Ace of Pentacles. Ace of Cups in the reverse for the person secretly crushing on Aquarius. Ten of Swords, see? See? Someone had high hopes for this relationship, but they didn't get it. They go to four wands again. See? Wow. I feel like somebody could see themselves in a long term relationship with you, but it seems like you weren't thinking like that. So I feel like your person is trying to let go and move on, move forward. Because they got to see because you got the ace of swords. They already know. And like, I feel like it's hurt. It hurts. But they, they got the truth. They know the truth. So it's like somebody is taking off the uh, facade, the illusions, looking at things for what they really are and moving on. It's what I feel like. But I feel like it was hard for them. See, now they're going to be single to see. I feel like this person ain't going to want to date nobody. And then it could also represent that you got this person feeling some type of way because you don't want no commitment. But now you got the nine of pentacles again. 
What's up with this nine of pentacles for the person secretly crushing on Aquarius? Now it could seem to be that this is how they view you or this is how they feel. Nine of pentacles. Ace of wands. Somebody could be feeling like you done went off and started some, somewhere that you just didn't want to settle down. Somebody could look at you like you're, you're not wanting to settle down with them. See? You're not looking for nobody to be serious with. Although they wanted a relationship with you, they're looking at you as just out here living your life and dating people casually. And they feel like they're in the same category. Just some friends with benefits once again. Nothing serious. Because it's all about you in this nine of pentacles. Yeah, I feel like things that came to a standstill with you and this person because it seems like maybe you're out dating other people because you are single. You can. So I'm getting the impression that your person feels like you're single because you want to date multiple people. You're not ready to settle down. And I feel like it hurts because they're in love and they're being rejected. And now they're having to find the strength to move on. Two of Pentacles in reverse. I feel like somebody's finally realizing that they done lost and they got to let go and move on. Oof. Ace of Pentacles for the person secretly crushing on Aquarius. What's up with this Ace of Pentacles? I feel like you focus on money. Mm. They go to Ace of Cups. Somebody got something new coming in. It could be that your person is finding out that you went and started new somewhere else. Could be a Scorpio. Leo. Got a ten of swords hangman. Pisces, the Empress. They go to Sunk. I tell you, some came out. And you know if you're dealing with a Queen of Cups, she gonna find out. So if they're secretly crushing and fight, spying on you, then they done came up with the conclusion that the reason why things didn't go nowhere with you two is because you didn't want nothing. You didn't want to settle down. You may have been dating other people and they messed around and, and fell in love. And, and as a result, feel like they didn't get what they wanted. Temperance. I feel like somebody here, I feel like somebody um, is imbalanced. Or somebody here has been waiting for something to change between the two of you. Your person could have been hoping that of your other relationships come, come, uh, come apart so that they could have a chance with you. See, they go to Queen of Wands. See, you got a lot of folks in here. And it could be the same one, the Queen of uh, the Empress. I feel like it's the Empress, it's the same one. They felt like they were the one for you, but you didn't see that. I do feel like your person's going to eventually walk away and let this go, though. Or they're saying, because you already got the Eight of Cups up here. Why is the Eight of Cups here for the person secretly crushing on Aquarius? Eight of Cups. Why is the Eight of Cups here? Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. Clarify the Eight of Cups. Seven of Pentacles. I feel like somebody is tired of waiting. Somebody's finally got clear about what type it is and what really going on. And I feel like somebody's finally accepting it for what it really is. I feel like it hurts them, but I feel like somebody knows that they got to move on. See? Three of swords. See? See? So you got a soulmate from your past that's in love that, that thought that you guys could have had a relationship. But I feel like your person's finally going to come to a place where they're going to realize that uh, it's just not uh, it's just not a balanced relationship. It's one side and that somebody doesn't want what they want and they're going to pull their stuff together and they're going to walk away from this. All right, Aquarius, this is the person secretly crushing on you. So if it resonates, please like, share and subscribe.